While most stock camera apps on Android come with a pro mode these days, there are still quite a few phones that don't offer manual controls on the camera. However, there are some great pro camera apps on the Play Store that you can use in case your phone's camera app doesn't offer manual controls or, you know, just lets you adjust the white balance and exposure in the name of manual controls. Yeah, there are some phones that do that. Hey guys, this is Abhijit from Guiding Tech and in this video, we'll take a look at the five best pro camera apps that you can get on Android right away. So let's get right to it. Let's kick things off with Open Camera App, a feature-packed camera app that's completely open source and free to use. The app includes pretty much everything you'd expect from a pro camera app, including complete manual controls with which you can adjust the focus, white balance, ISO, and even the exposure compensation. Now, in order to use these features, your device should support the Camera 2 API, and this stands true for all of the apps on this list. Apart from manual controls, the Open Camera app also includes several different modes, including a pretty handy HDR mode that snaps multiple pictures of the same frame to deliver the best results. The app also allows you to capture images in RAW, which will give you the highest level of quality and more freedom when you try to edit the images later on. The only downside to using the Open Camera app is its interface. It's a bit old-timey and isn't all that responsive, but if it's just the results that you care about, then you can't go wrong with this app. But personally, I really dislike the interface of this one. Then we have the footage camera that brings together all the features and capabilities you would expect from a pro camera app and presents them in a modern, clean and easy to use interface. With this app, you'll be able to make use of all the Camera 2 API features, including complete manual controls and a host of other features like the ability to create GIFs directly from within the app. The app also has a bunch of device-specific features like RAW format support and HDR plus support. But the most unusual feature of the lot is the app's ability to separate focus and exposure to different points in a frame. That's pretty cool, I would say. And this is actually something that I haven't seen in many other camera apps. So that was footage and now we have the HCam 2, an app based on the open camera source code that brings some major improvements to the open camera app. It has a slightly more modern interface that's customizable and much easier to use than the one that you get with the open camera. Now, when it comes to features, the app includes everything that you get with the open camera, along with additions like an advanced selfie mode with which you can take selfies using voice commands or facial recognition. Isn't that cool? Moving on, we have this app, which is, I would say, an unusual addition to this list. I'm talking about the Adobe Lightroom app. Now, if you're wondering why we have included an image editing app in a video that's about best camera apps, then you'd be surprised to know that Lightroom comes with a feature-packed manual camera built-in. Yep, that's right. Just tap on the camera icon in the bottom right and then switch to the camera mode from Auto to Pro. In the Pro mode, you'll be able to control the focus, ISO, white balance and shutter speed to capture that perfect shot before you go ahead and also edit it in the same app. The app also includes support for raw format capture, which works quite well within the app's ability to edit raw photos. This means that Lightroom can easily be your one-stop solution for all your pro photography needs on your phone. And the best part? You can use all of these features without paying for an Adobe Creative Cloud subscription. Now that's really the best thing. Rounding things off is Pixtica. Yeah, that's kind of a tongue twister of a name. Now, there's an all new camera app from the developers of the popular Cameringo camera app that seamlessly combines a modern interface with an impressive set of features. As you'd expect, the app includes full manual controls, allowing you to adjust the ISO shutter speed and all these things, apart from the ability to capture in RAW format. The app also offers a bunch of other interesting features like live filters, GIF recorder, hyperlapse mode, and one of my favorites, the tiny planet mode, with which you can create little planets of whatever you are capturing in real time. That's kind of fun. While all of these features are available in the free version of the app, there are a few annoying limitations. The free version doesn't let you click photos in full resolution. And if you use any of the special features, the app adds a rather large watermark to the images. It does offer a paid monthly subscription to get rid of all the limitations and at 370 bucks for a year, uh, it's kind of worth it. Well, that's it for this video. Do check out all these pro camera apps on your phone and let us know which one you like the most. And don't forget to hit a like button if you like this video and also subscribe to Guiding Tech. 
This is Abhijit signing off and I'll see you in the next one.